It's hard to look back and see the truth about people you love. I think if you asked Derek why it all went the way it did and where it all started, he'd still say it started when our father was murdered. <laughs> but the truth is, it started earlier. All right. Are we all meeting together for the game tonight? Yes, definitely. All right, Ben's Burger is 7 o'clock, then we go watch the big guy play. Okay. Huh? Yeah. You psyching up for the game? Oh, yeah, I'm always ready for that. I got I got an English exam, third period. I'm having a heart attack. I'm not ready. What's the matter, Fred? You're going to get a B? <laughs> <laughs> Might do you good. B minus. Oh! Hey, don't laugh. I'm telling you, this guy is different. Dr. Sweeney, this guy's unbelievable. Unbelievable. It's, I've never had a teacher like this. He's got, like, two PhDs. I don't know what he's doing teaching in our school. He's not like other teachers. What's he got you reading? I mean, we got this essay exam on this book, Native Son, all in this one book. Native Son, what's that? I don't know that. Well, that's a big surprise. <laughs> what, I read? <laughs> Honey, they don't teach Tom Clancy in school. <laughs> well, they don't. Uh, so what is it? What is this Native Son? What is it? I think it's like this, it's like this book about this black guy, you know? It's, it's, we're doing this whole black literature, you know? What is it, Black History Month? No, it's just like this guy Sweeney, you know? You, it's part of the course now. Yeah. What? Nothing. It's just, you know, it's everywhere I look now. What? This affirmative black chin. Honey, a few new books doesn't qualify as affirmative black action. Hey, read the book, ace the guy's test. Just don't swallow everything he feeds you whole. You know, just because you see it on the evening news. No, but like what? All this stuff about making everything equal, it's not that simple. Look, now you got this book, Native Son. You know, what happened to the other books in the course? They're not any good anymore because Mr. Two PhD says they aren't? <laughs> huh? I mean, you got to trade in great books for black books? Does that make sense? Huh? You got to question these things, Dare. You got to look at the whole picture. You know, yeah. we're talking about books here. But I'm also talking about my job. I got two black guys on my squad now who got their job over a couple of white guys who actually scored higher in the test. Does that make sense? Huh? Yeah, sure, everything's equal now. But I got two guys watching my back, responsible for my life, who aren't as good as two other guys. You only got the job because they were black, not because they were the best. That, that sucks. Yeah. Is that what America's about? No, America's about best man for the job. You do your best. You get the job. You know, this affirmative action crap. I don't know what that's about. There's like some hidden agenda or something going on. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, I do. I don't know. I didn't think about it like that. Well, this guy, though, I don't know. Dr. Swing, he comes on like so strong. It's, it's kind of hard not to listen to him, but I don't know. Maybe some of what he says is kind of... It's bullshit. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. No, no. It's nigger bullshit. You see that, don't you? Yeah. You gotta watch out for that. Yeah, no, I, I get what you're saying. I will. Good boy. Proud of you. Yeah, don't worry about it. Got it. <laughs>